Hello, so I I have a video. Yes, it is Saturday edition video. Yes, let's let's get into it. So this one is going to be more like council stuff. So but before I get into that, I'm going to just read a comment. Um Kieran the Goober had commented on the past two videos like this asking how I felt about people dubbing my content, like people dubbing my comics or my stories, and I just want to say that I get really excited. Like, I will sit there and smile like a goof the whole video, and I don't know why it just makes me so happy to see these things. I don't know, it makes me really happy. So, to answer your question, I, I love it when people dub my stuff, and if you ever want to, feel free to do so. And please send me the link because I want to see it. On to the council stuff. So, there was um, somebody who had commented in the past video. Um, they're actually, uh, their name is Mars. Bur I can't pronounce that last name. Mars. We're going to go with Boudreau Exicus. Yeah, we're going to go with that. Um, and they were the ones who actually created Bailey for me, um, like the general design and stuff. And then I went through and like tweaked a lot of things. So credit to them for um, helping with uh, the creation of Bailey. Um, so they had some questions on the council and stuff. So first one, why are everybody, why does everybody in the afterlife have red eyes? Why did it take me so long to think of how to phrase that? Um, Everybody has red eyes just because I could. Um, I think it was just kind of following the trend because Diana, who came first, had red eyes. And then Nadraj rolled in. She also had red eyes. And then when I created Anne, she just followed the trend. And then everybody after that just kind of like followed the trend of red eyes. And I was also too lazy to pick colors for eyes. Oh, jeez. So, yeah. Um... There are a couple characters who don't have red eyes, but, like, their default is red eyes, but, like, they can change the color to what, what they prefer. So, like, Blue, who's Robin's depression voice, has blue eyes, but it's more of, like, a personal choice that she just likes them. Um, like, I can picture- I picture her, like, being able to, like, by default just put them back to red. I don't know. I picture them- so, like, they're kind of able to tweak their appearance when they want to kind of thing. Um, they just don't do it very often, because why would they, you know? Why, why confuse people? So, next thing is evolution of the bosses. So, I would say out of all my characters, the bosses have gone through the least evolution. Um, if anything, I think their relationships with people have changed. So, like, Max, for example, I think she's gone through the most changes. Um, when I created her, she was more of a very, like, in like intimidating and I'm going to, like, beat you up. Like, I'm, uh, I don't know, she wasn't, like, as nice of a person, but now she's, like, really chill. She's got a group of friends. She's the friendlier one. She's the one you would least expect to, like, come after you. Um, but she's also, she looks intimidating, but she's not, kind of thing. Um, and she's basically friends with, like, everybody, and yeah. So, basically, the relationships are probably the thing that's evolved the most, because I wanted, like, the group to be like dynamic in a way like they're not all close friends and they all have people they like and dislike as in with like every friend group kind of thing so it's kind of really realistic i guess i'm hoping i don't know um next one what happened to the boss's family so um i'm really good at killing off characters if you haven't noticed i yeah um I can list off a couple- oh jeez, that's, that's, that's a big hairball, where did that come from? Um, I can list off a few, um, so for Max, uh, she w had a husband, and, um, it, w it wasn't, like, a great relationship, like, you gotta think, she's- in the 1800s, she's a black woman, like, she's probably not, like, it's unlikely that she was treated the best, you know what I mean? So- she had a husband, the relationship wasn't that great, and 
she was also cheating on him so that that's a whole different story um her husband was beatrice's um brother yeah and so like that's kind of like their families um eventually like the husband was the one who took out max because he found out about her cheating through beatrice and yeah so technically her family never really like died or anything but like if you look at like debbie um she had a husband and like she's like the grandmother kind of figure and they grew old together but eventually she lost her husband and then went into deep dark depression and yeah um i picture like dallas having a normal family you know normal parents because he was he's like 18 19 i can't remember so still living at home um i haven't really thought much about anybody else's family so most of them it was either just they kind of like fizzled out of their life or they were there and just not talked about last part other reps so i think they were asking if there are other reps that are not talked about and yes there are um there are actually many um i just never created them so like usually one i don't talk about very often is blue which again is robin's depression i don't talk about her a lot but she is there um basically i made the series so people could put their characters in it so like if you are somebody who has a mental illness and you kind of picture it as a voice it's a very like it's very easy to like insert the character in there and um yeah um there are also other council members that are just like i haven't created them because there are millions of mental illnesses and i could never create that many characters i have way too many as it is so like that's it's kind of like you gotta imagine these things i guess so yeah there are other reps and bosses i just have not created them i want to stick to the main ones that i have um because otherwise i'm going to just lose my mind with the amount of characters i have yeah this video is getting way too long so i'm gonna cut it short feel free to leave a comment about what you want to see next in the description bye